Let's look at the function of glycogen as an energy reservoir in our body. Glycogen is used as a form of storage of glucose in our body. It is mainly found in the liver and the muscle. The liver glycogen stores can provide for itself and the body. However, the muscle glycogen stores are only available for the muscle. Do remember that glycogen stores are finite. So after you eat a meal, the glucose first fills up the glycogen stores and then converts the remaining to fats. When you start exercising, there's a rapid demand for ATP. This demand is satisfied by phosphocreatine and glycolysis. Thus, glycogen can provide a local, immediate, and rapid source of glucose. Glycogen is a polymer of glucose and highly branched molecule. There are two types of linkages. The alpha-1,4 will form the linear chain, whereas the alpha-1,6 linkage will form branches. Glycogen is stored in the cytoplasm and usually found associated with multiple proteins. Glycogen degradation, or also known as glycogenolysis, is a process of removing glucose molecules from the non-reducing ends. Glycogen, as you can see here, has multiple non-reducing ends. Thus, you can provide glucose at a very fast rate from glycogen. Glycogen synthesis, known as glycogenesis, is the conversion of glucose into glycogen. UDP glucose is the building block for glycogen, and it requires energy in the form of UTP. Here is a diagram to summarize the synthesis and degradation steps. This is just a summary and does not show all the details. Glucose is converted to glucose 6-phosphate by hexokinase. This is your first step of glycolysis. Glucose 6-phosphate is then converted to glucose 1-phosphate by phosphoglucomutase. After a series of steps, Glucose 1-phosphate is converted to glycogen. The major enzyme here is glycogen synthase. Also remember, this reaction requires UTP. Now degradation of glycogen also has a series of steps to get to glucose 1-phosphate, and the major enzyme is called glycogen phosphorylase. Glucose 1-phosphate is converted back to glucose 6-phosphate by the same enzyme, phosphoglucomutase. In muscle, glucose 6-phosphate would continue into glycolysis. However, only in the liver it is converted back to the glucose by glucose 6-phosphatase, which can then go into the bloodstream. Thank you. If you have any questions, please use the comment section below.